Hello everybody and welcome back once again to Machine Gun and today I have a pop unboxing video from Entertainment Earth for you as well as a little extra surprise from Shark Robot because I collect more than Funko Pops and this came at the same time and I thought it'd be really cute to open with you guys. So we'll start with the pop first. I noticed on the box that it kind of got, I don't know if you can see it, it's like dinged in, there's like an indent. Now you can see it like that. So I'm hoping that the um that the pop's okay usually entertainment earth is pretty good for like putting other stuff around the pops so we're gonna find out but we'll open this yeah okay so as you can see they uh they did bubble wrap it so hopefully she didn't take any damage i can already see some damage all right, so I was actually finally able to get a hold of this, the the END Natsu Dragneel from Fairy Tail. Um, I can see there is, I don't know if you can pick it much up on camera. There, oh, there we go. Okay, there's a crease right here that lifts up. And there's also a small cut, a small rip right here. Um, that's not really the packaging's fault. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah. So this box, you can tell, it goes in and then back out. It it really did take a a good hit. There we go. You can kind of see it better here. You can like see the creases. So yeah, the box took a pretty good hit, and that's not the packager's fault. That is whoever decided to deliver this package and fucking drop it. So unfortunately, Entertainment Earth usually does me pretty good, and unfortunately, my Natsu came with damage on both sides. And the back is also creased in because the side is crushed in. This makes me very upset. I'll have to see if I can find another one. But he is pretty hard to find because he was uh, from one of the cons and he sold out pretty quickly. Um, weirdly enough, Entertainment Earth was getting him back in stock for some reason. So I was able to grab him. But the shipping's kind of expensive because I'm in Canada. So I don't like to do small orders by any means. I bought a $20 pop, and it cost me $20 to ship it, so it was very expensive. But yeah, so unfortunately, this is now like a fucking 5 out of 10 for boxing. The pop itself is really cool. It almost looks like he's wearing a mask, but it's just like the angry shadow. He actually like is up on like his flames, like he was in this part of the anime. I really do like it, which is nice. But I'm just playing it came broken. And this is from Shark Robot. I am a huge fan of Vivi Pops, Hasbro Hotel, and Hello Boss. And for Halloween, or not Halloween, for Valentine's Day, they did these absolutely adorable pins. I love pins. I collect pins. I collect pops. I collect coins. I'm just a strange collector of things. And yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna rip this bad boy open and uh, show you guys the pins. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, one of these pins are wrong. So I got Millie, which I did order. Look at that pin up pin. Absolutely adorable. This is that little office romance pin, which I thought was cute as fuck. And I have a Luna pin for some reason, but I know I didn't order a Luna pin. As it says on the thing, I ordered a Angel Dust pin. So I'm sorry. I'm going to have to, uh, oh good, they have the email on it, perfect, because I received, the Luna's really cute, but, um, I ordered Angel Dust, and I really wanted Angel Dust's pin. But yeah, no, these pins are absolutely fucking adorable. Yeah, cute as hell. If you haven't seen Hello Boss or Hasbin Hotel, I thoroughly recommend you get on your YouTube, look up Hasbin Hotel. It has gone off the chains. It came out uh, just over a year ago, I think, the pilot came out last year. And it literally went skyrocketing popularity. It is about, uh, it's about hell, as you can see. They 
she's like a demon and uh super overpowered demons a lot of very inappropriate jokes it's designed for 18 plus so there's lots of jokes about um sexuality and drugs and stuff like that if you're under 18 you're not really supposed to watch it it is an adult show she ended up getting picked up by a2 which is a tv company so there will be an entire season of has been hotel probably next year i want to say because they announced that last year so i'm hoping maybe we'll see something for next year and she updates hell of a bus every month or so so check that out too absolutely adorable but yeah so that was Natsu from Entertainment Earth for Fairy Tale and some beautiful Vivi Pop from Shark Robot Pins. Feel free to check it out. I will also be posting this bad boy on my Funko Instagram, which is Funko Pop Collector 99. Feel free to pop over and check it out. If you like the content, please feel free to like, subscribe, and have a fantastic evening.